What is up guys, Nick here and today I will be counting down the top 10 block textures in Minecraft resource packs. So a lot of people have said that the blocks in my texture packs are too overused, which is true because I can't have the time to get different blocks for every pack to enhance the experience. I specialize mainly in animating PvP items so if you're not happy with the blocks in my packs feel free to steal the blocks folder from one of the packs in this list as long as you don't release it or re-upload the pack. This video will be really useful if you're making a texture pack of your own and want to decide which blocks to use. Note that these are in no particular order and the down links are available in the description. Number 1 is Redcraft. It is available in all sizes from 32x32 32 32 to 512x512. 512 it is an extremely realistic and popular pack and the blocks have been used in a large number of PvP texture packs including a lot of my own packs. There are two versions, the default realism and the smooth realism. Number 2 is Faithful. I'm sure you guys have all heard of the Faithful texture pack. It is available in all sizes from 32x32 32 32 to 512x512 512 512, and it is basically a more HD version of default and as you can see it makes the game a lot smoother. This is one of the most common used texture packs in all kinds of PvP edits and it is very popular especially in the raiding pvp factions community. Number 3 is Triton V4. This pack is available from 64x64 to 512x512 and it brings a dark cartoony and sharp look to the game. Its blocks are unique and detailed and make Minecraft look a lot more vibrant. It also comes with a custom sounds pack. This pack also has a custom title screen, really sick custom widgets, particles and even 3D grass. Many of the blocks and items are animated such as the ores, glowstone and redstone lamps, and even the swords and tools are really good. Number 4 is Deathscape. This is also a well known pack and its blocks and items are used in many edits, especially in the MCSG and survival games community. Its item set is also very popular in many PvP edits, although I'm personally not a big fan of this texture pack. The colours of the blocks make the game look unusually bright and low contrast, but it is still a pretty nice texture pack for blocks. Number 5 is Realistico. Although this texture pack is missing several textures, the blocks in this pack are extremely realistic and excellent if you have a really fast computer, especially with shaders on. It is only available in 512 resolution, so only use this if you have a good PC. Number 6 is called Paper Cutout. This is a nice and clean looking default edit and it has some really unique blocks. It is ideal for slower computers or if you just want to use a texture pack without lagging your game. It is only available in 16x16 and it is best for PvP default edits. Number 7 is Chroma Hills. If you're a fan of medieval themes or grunge textures, this might be a good pack for you. It is available in 64x64 and 128x128. Number 8 is called Simply Sharp. It is kind of cartoony look and it is similar to Sfax Pure BD Craft but it is slightly brighter and has less detail. It's still a really clean pack without any grungy textures. Number 9, I have no idea which pack this is originally from because I've seen this in countless PvP edits that use these blocks so I'm just gonna call it the HCF blocks because I have seen many hardcore factions players use these block textures and it is only a 16x16 default edit and it is very clean with a unique look and it doesn't have a lot of contrast. Note that the download link isn't of the entire pack, it is just a blocks folder. Number 10 is Fax Pure BD Craft. This is an extremely popular pack with over 2.1 million downloads. It even appeared on the Guinness World Record 2016 for the most downloaded Minecraft texture pack. I mean seriously, why is this even on there? This pack is available in 16x16 up to 512x512 and there are many variations also available on their website. Thanks for watching guys, if you like this video please leave a thumbs up and if you're new make sure you hit subscribe and if you want to check out some epic animated pvp texture packs with some animated swords and animated pvp items check out my youtube channel. I create one animated pvp texture pack every milestone so I don't miss out. All the downloads are in the description, I'll see you all tomorrow, peace.